Hey guys, this is Brett Douglas with Ironclad Landscape Management. Hey, just wanted to show y'all, we're uh, sitting out here on a property. This is the one that I was talking about the other day. It was in Orlando, if you, most of y'all remember, that follow along our exploits. This is the one that uh, we came in and um, had a 1970s feel to it. Lots of rock and stone out here, and we kind of came out and did a major rehab. Had some trees taken out, stump ground. And then, uh, basically, you know, we uh, prepped everything out the other day. Took a couple days to get back to the project. We could meet the homeowner on today, Thursday, at the nursery. Just wanted to kind of show you a little bit what we do. Remember we talked about that we created some new bed lines for her. And then uh, we've got a nice mixture here. We don't want to be overpowering. She's a very simplistic person. So what we did is we uh, take some Maui Exoras, got some Jack Frost Lycidiums, kind of to blend that in. Over here we're going to go with the nice Caladiums. Got a lot of colorful Caladiums. They're in the little four inch, six inch pots. Notice now they're they're really like a soft tissue plant, so they lay over in the heat right now. But as soon as they uh, but as soon as they get some water on them, they'll flush right back and they'll be awesome. So we're gonna go ahead and finish this brick ring all the way around. We've uh, toiled tilled the soil. We're gonna clean that up a little bit more. Put these caladiums in; they'll do real well. Want to show you this uh, this bed line over here. Um, when we had done this, this was a really big. If you guys remember, we had a huge hodgepodge of stuff in here. We're gonna shrink our beds down. We have too much. It was way too busy of a of a landscape area. If you notice, where are you guys running to? Y'all hiding over there? Is it hot? Yeah, All right, man. Social media. Uh, it's the danger of being around working with Brett Douglas. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, my guys are doing awesome. Sean's just joined the crew. Mr. Sean, Mr. Raymond, they work great. And uh, the other day we were doing preservation, now today we're doing landscaping. But uh, basically what they've done, the guys have prepped this out for me. So what we did, we're gonna match the sod over here and we're gonna bring the sod back and kind of have a little lawn clave here around our mailbox. So we've uh, shrunk the beds down. Wanted to show you, we've got some tricolor azimuth, jasmine. We have Jack Frost Lycidium. We remember our Muscargi La Rope that was all up in here, really mature. We've cut this into little sprigs. We've replanted them, repurposed them. Now, if you start to see, we've got uh, our mother-in-law tongues in the back. We'll go ahead and got that set up over there. Here we've got some beautiful assortment of plants. We've got the crotons in the back. And uh, we're gonna go ahead with um, some red fountain grass in the back. We've got Podocarpus, Japanese yew, that we're gonna have a formal type shrub back there. We just brought in a new beautiful Robolini. If you notice our cute little Robolini, we wanted a shielding agent for the windows. And then we're gonna let these Podocarpus grow up and kind of shade that over there. So we have created a nice uh, level landscape where we're gonna have it layered. We have our ground cover jasmine that's in, the Maui Xoras, then we have our nice red fountain grass, and then we got the Podocarpus, Japanese yew. We have a Texas sage we put in over here and some oyster plant. Looks really nice. Of course, that fake thing back there is coming out. We've got a screen being put in there. This is some of the old stuff we ripped out. This is kind of our little holding area over here. This is the Muscargi La Rope, you guys, I was telling you about. You can basically dig this up, repurpose it, take a sharp instrument, cut that down, and then you can reuse that. Um, just want to keep the uh, in a little nursery area over here when you're always doing a landscape area. You want to have a nice area you can keep it irrigated and watered. Once again, this is where we're staging our stuff. Got the boys, uh, we're trying to stay hydrated out here. You guys get some drink, man. Hide out. Crank up that AC for a minute, wait. Then uh, you wanted to kind of show you back over here. Got all our tools waiting here. But now we've got a nice little bed line and all we're doing is we're gonna, last things to finish up, we're gonna get this sodded and then we're gonna uh, get the mulch in here. So once again, we'll talk with you guys in a little bit and we will uh, show a picture as soon as we've got it finished. Thanks, have a great day. Hope you guys are staying cool, it's hot out here.